ready again. Here we go. Boom. In the sky. Blast wave. And... Nice. There we go. I have really been wanting to try this new explosive bomb ability. So I saw this thing in the trailer for the update, but I haven't seen it at all actually in the game. So I just unlocked one of these. It's called Blast Wave. Sets a bomb exploding after a short timer. Damages and pushes away all enemies in radius. That sounds pretty cool. We also have enough energy for a homing missile. The homing missile kind of sucks, but we do have the new Blast Wave. So let's give this thing a try and let's get into it. All right, um, let's drop in the Aries first. So, oh, we're in Elimination. So look on the top of the screen. That, with all those bars, those are all the players. And then the dots are all the players' robots. Let's try this thing out. Whoa, that's kind of wild. You just launch the thing. What is it, a 15 second cooldown? So you deploy the little bomb and then it explodes. It doesn't look like a massive explosion, but supposedly it pushes actual enemies back. Let's try it out. Okay. Shred this guy. Shields up. Boom. Do we get the kill? Oh, we got the kill. I hate how the skull faces don't come up in elimination when you get the kill. So you have to look to the right side of the screen. There's a guy around on the minimap here. Where is he? Right here. Okay, blast. Whoa, it launches him into the air. So I couldn't see how much damage that dealt. But it like pushed him into the into the sky a bit. Here. Okay, there we go. We took some damage though. We did take some damage and we do not have a regenerate armor. Our torso is completely shredded up. Okay, see what's 34, 31. It's better to have the higher number in this. Okay, homing missile. I'm just gonna shred him. Boom! Didn't even need to use the uh, the blast wave. Okay, let's wait for. Remember, beacons in elimination they're only used for uh, drop points, not actual beacon bar. Oh, they're all at center. You can see they're all at center beacon on the mini map. It's like three or four of them. Oh, guy, guy, guy! Blast wave. There it goes again. It pushes him. It pushes him into the sky, and I think his armor slightly turned color, which means it damaged his armor a bit. It's a pretty short cooldown on the on the blast wave. I want to try to hit like multiple enemies. It's ready again. Here we go. Boom! In the sky. Blast wave, and nice. There we go. Blast waved, and then we shredded him up with the Punishers. This build is surprisingly well. You've got to be accurate with the shots, though. Whoa. No. Oh. Okay, where should I launch this? Where should I deploy this? Uh, you can deploy it pretty accurately. I'm surprised. I thought it was kind of just a shoot out of your robot thing. Where the hell is this guy? I don't know where this is. Okay, I'm going to cancel that. There's a Fury right here. I just activated it inside here and it blew out all the windows. Here we go. Nice, okay, we got him, we got him. We, I think we got the kill actually with the homing missile that time. Okay, where's this guy? This is the guy I was looking at earlier. Okay, launch blast wave. Hit them both. It did 21,000 damage. That doesn't seem like a huge amount. But maybe it wasn't like dead on. I'm waiting for my ability a bit. Fury come down the pipe. Man, Furies are such big targets. They're great for Punishers. Dead. Here we go. Time bomb. Boom, launched them both into the air. And I think I got an assist there. Oh! Bro. My stupid teammate didn't move out of the way. The stupid bot teammate didn't move out of the way. And it killed me. That was dumb. Extra dumb. Okay, we're, we're doing pretty good with that Ares and the time bomb. Until... 
I'm shooting through this wall until that freaking teammate. That's hold on. There we go. Okay, we got the killer. That's one thing with uh, bot teammates. They don't move at all, so they can straight up get you killed. If you're getting, if you're trying to get to cover, they just won't move, and you can die. This is a close game. Even though we're like almost in their spawn, it's a close game. Here we go. Four screen. They can't go through that. Whoa, whoa. A shield. What? We put a shield up, but how did we die so fast? I thought I activated my shield. It's actually a tied game now. This isn't good. Lots of guys here. Well, okay, see, this is the one thing. Okay, abort, abort. Run, run, run. Oh, we're low health. Man, that's the one thing about elimination. It doesn't really favor you to drop in closer to the enemies. It's more exciting, but it doesn't really matter at the end of the day. Because there's no beacons, there's no territory control. Okay, there we go. Okay, our armor is almost completely shredded. Let's hit him with a blinder. There, I just hit him with the blinder. I'm moving in. Bingo. Okay, okay. We're good, we're good. 18-15. We got a three-kill lead. You can see on the minimap, they're all stacked up around this center building. There's one guy. Group these shots. There we go. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. Got the assist. Wasn't it just 1813? I thought I just killed somebody. Shouldn't it be 1812 now? Alpha. Oh, at 2% health. I'm at 2%. Did I hit him there? Oh, it didn't. It missed him. The blinder missed him. Cha-ching. Oh, assist. Man, see, elimination does... It can get pretty crazy, but also sometimes it's annoying because players camp as well. So it's kind of love-hate game mode. I still think I like Beacon Rush better. Beacon Rush will always be the most fun for me. There we go. That was our kill. Drop the shield. We're low HP. We're super low HP. I'm probably going to die here. Yeah, I knew I was going to die. Okay, what's the score? Look at all these explosions. It seems like both teams were just piled into this small part of the map. Oh, this guy's right here. Firing at his torso. Come on, ball of eggs. Okay. 12 8. We got two alphas here. Fire away at that guy. We're hitting him, we're hitting him. Oh, guys, right here. Teammate, my, my bot teammate is glitching out, and he is not doing anything to help me, and he's dead. Oh, this ain't good, this ain't good. We're taking damage, we're taking damage. Oh, I was getting hit by too many. Ah, oh, I feel like my team's being too aggressive, almost. We got two robots left, and this is a close game. We're losing drop points. It's 9-8. We have a one kill lead now. Here we are. Here's a guy. Drop the shield right away. There's one. Okay, let's move and reload. So they got seven robots left in total, which is still a good amount. Abort, abort. Okay, I'm gonna use my regenerate armor here. He's coming around. There he is. We're shredding him up. His torso is cooked. Yes. All right. Seven six. Okay, so you can see on the top of the screen, three of their players are mecked out. That's why the uh, the icons kind of uh, not invisible, but see through. Two of my players on my team are mech'd out too. Whoa! Ooh, 
Okay, that's a lot of damage. Okay, my shielding is ready. I'm gonna just reload here. Two, one. Where'd he go? Did he go in the center? There he is. Torso. There we go again. Okay, there's two guys in the center. They have four robots left. This is a close game. This is a surprisingly close game. I have one other robot after this, but I don't really want to leave it to the last robot. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. 6-2. Two. two players left. Two robots left. Where are they? There's two robots left in the whole game. Oh, there's one. And an alpha. Got him. Fire away, teammate. Fire away. Reloading, reloading. Come on, let's get him straight through that armor. Oh, we're taking damage though too. Oh, somebody kill him. Somebody. There we go. Okay, my teammate killed him. All right, that was a good game. That was surprisingly close in elimination. So that's the, the what is it called? Blast wave bomb ability. It's an interesting concept of an ability, but look at that, 4.2 million damage, not too bad. I wouldn't recommend that ability. It's cool, it's a nice idea, but it doesn't deal enough damage to really justify using it over other better abilities. So there it is, Blast Wave, peace. Mixerial Lettuce Man.